This looks gorgeous. Let's move it, on it, from the side. It, it, it's a stunner. This is a, a, a dessert that dazzles. Yeah, I think. colours. Big centrepiece. It's mm. my uh, my lemon tart with raspberries. You know, it's a perfect way to celebrate the end of the summer kind of thing, bank holiday weekend and everything. And also, you might think, oh, it looks really difficult, but actually, let's go for it, yeah? OK, let's right. go for okay, it. OK, right, so it's a tart, so we're going to need a tart case. We're going to need pastry, yeah? yeah? So these are your options. You could have... Obviously, a packet pastry, mm -hmm. a tart shell. That would be or, easy. Or you can do what I mean, that, that's the quicker route, admittedly, yeah. of course. However, I pre rolled one earlier this morning and baked it, as you can see here. Now, these are baking ba beans because it's been baked for 20 minutes at 180. The recipe for my pastry is on the website, on the main so website. So that's blind baking. Blind isn't it? baking. Yeah. So that is now completely cooked, OK? But we're going to put the filling in it. Right, the filling is lemons, obviously, yes, it's lemon tart. However, we have eggs, right? So we've got um, five eggs and one egg white. The, oh, the other okay. yolk is there where we've done the glaze on it. And uh -huh. that just that, se that seals the pastry, OK, as you can see. OK, right now, we've got the eggs in there. Simple as this. We're going to go in with sugar. If it comes <laughs> out. It comes out. <laughs> <laughs> no, it does. Look, sugar. I just <laughs> part of my fingers. Sugar goes in there. <laughs> Some lemon zest, Ooh. quite a few, right? Five lemons in this one. Yeah, so you'll need, that's why there's a lot of sugar as well. Well, actually, I've cut down the sugar amounts because ah. I like it, I like it tartar. Yeah. Right, I like a tartar tart. Don't Does that we make all, sense? Don't right. we all. <laughs> right. I'm not even going there either. <laughs> right, anyway, eggs, sugar, lemon. Okay, right, now here we have some whipped cream, half whipped cream. And as you can see, it's thick, just only starting to hold. Yeah. Okay, this will obviously give it a bit of lightness and heaviness, richness, I should say, mm. as well. Okay, so in that goes there. Right, now, we're gonna fold, I should say fold, but you can just literally mix everything together with a whisk, okay? And just so it only just combines, you don't wanna over whisk it. Now, yeah. we're gonna get this mixture, we're going to put it into a jug. We've got an oven preheated, 160 degrees, OK? OK. And this is a slower cook, a slower bake. So we have our tart... Now we could use our tart case, but obviously I've got the other one done. Yeah. 160 degrees. Okay. Now this is where you need... I'm going to load myself up, ready? Because okay. I'm... Come to the oven with me. No, oh, I'm, I'm how going exciting! Well, you can if you want. Over? Yeah, come oh, on, why not? Do. OK, right. <laughs> OK, now, here we go. I don't know why I'm here, but... Because, anyway, because, <laughs> because, I'll, I'll show you. Watch this. I could have filled it up over there, but yeah. you've got to carry it and everything else. You want to take it to a full um, height on this one. So, right. I recommend putting the tart already in the oven. All right. Pulling it out. I'm going to stand around here so everyone can see. And load it up, OK? All and you would have out. oven gloves on by this point, I would No, hope. because, obviously, oh. the tray's cold, Fiona. Oh, the tray is cold. The <laughs> yeah. oven's hot, though. The oven's, the oven's pretty heated, yeah. <laughs> OK, right. Pop, push that in, and then it goes shut. Now, obviously, depending on what tart case you've got, yeah. depends on how much mixture you can fit into it. So the ball ones, I think, are a little, not as deep. Yeah. OK, so you can fill that one even more further up if you wanted to. OK. OK. Now, I've got one done here. Pre-baked off, so as I said, 150 degrees. That looks lovely. And it's literally, uh, excuse me, 160 60. degrees, excuse me, for 35 yeah. to 40 minutes. Okay. Now, you could just serve it as is. You could put icing sugar on it and stuff like that, but we're not doing that. I'm going to get some raspberries, OK? So it is the end of the summer. So these are fantastic. There's UK raspberries everywhere but, at the moment. Exa really, exactly exactly that. It is yeah. that peak season, right? So what I'm going to do is, is just start to load up the raspberries, but I'm not just going to throw them on, I'm going to do a nice decoration all the way around and you'll see towards um, the end of the show, I would have had time to finish this obviously, okay. but we'll finish this off. Another thing that I'm going to do as well is just use this, which is white chocolate. So a white chocolate bar and we get ourselves a potato peeler. You okay. could use a small knife, but I think this is easier to be honest. Yeah. And then we just take shavings and curls really. of chocolate that we're going to sprinkle over at the end. So come back at the end of the show, I would have done a lovely array of raspberries oh. on top here, white chocolate, and I think a bit of mint as well. Oh, so a there bit you go. of mint as well. I don't think I can do the rest of the show now. I think you should stay <laughs> here. <laughs> but we have installed the perfect lemon and raspberry tart, or tart of citron mm. with raspberries. Ladies, I'd like you to give it a go. So there's oh, one thank for you. you very so much. And there. there you are. Oh, I can taste it now. On top, yeah. Indeed, yeah. Try not to have too big a mouthful. So, mm. Finish it how you see fit. That's this is the kind of look that I like to go for, mm. and I think um, hopefully mm. it's sweet but sharpness as well. That's really nice. Oh. I would never think to put raspberries on a 
on a tart. Because mm. mm. you'd think it would be too tart, mm. but, but the white chocolate... Well, it's oh. creaminess, oh. yeah. Oh, it's, it's delicious. delicious.